Maybe you've noticed toilet paper still pretty tough to find. Well, our Steve Harris went on a mission today to find out why and ended up finding out when to find it. Look at that. Gas prices under $2, but no lines at the pumps. No, the line is here. Go through the line for toilet paper. Ah. Now, to be honest, I shot that video two months ago. But today, not much has changed. No lines, but no toilet paper either. I asked a therapist who studies human behavior what he thinks is behind this. First of all, panic. Panic, uh, in this case, you know, we're terrorized by this unknown you know, pandemic, right? I mean, this uh, hidden enemy or whatever. So what's going to happen? We go, oh, shoot, I better get to get some of that stuff because it's going to be a week or two before I can get to it. I mean, you can find this, but it's more like rice paper. If you can walk on it without tearing it, you become a martial arts master. And check this out. One ply is actually transparent. Don't they make Charmin anymore? Their website says they do. Producing at record highs. And what about this commercial for Quilted Northern? You've seen it. Working day and night. Really? I hadn't noticed. So I wanted to get to the bottom of this. I emailed both companies, but I didn't get a response. Then I remembered this Facebook picture. My uncle bought that toilet paper for me, so I asked him how he made it happen. Early in the morning, from the time they open for about the next two hours would be the best time. So this morning, 8 a.m., I hit Target. Shelves still empty. But Deerberg's by 8.30? Look at that. Shelf full of Angel Soft. What about Walmart? Well, that is where I hit the mother load. Shelves fully stocked with every major brand, just like the old days. This could be a sign that things are getting better, or it could be a sign that the early bird actually does catch the worm. Steve Harris, News 4. Oh, maybe a combination of those two things.